you server at the Mallard Lounge for thinking that since her parents could do this, we might be able to manage it. Yeah. <laughs> We're Chris and Melissa, midlifers on the move. We heard about how great it is to hike the Chief Trail in Squamish, British Columbia, so we decided to give it a go and see for ourselves. Okay, so you can see we're at a pretty beautiful place. The amazing sea behind us and then the amazing mountains <laughs> in front of us. Melissa, are you scared? No. We're going to the Stowamis Chief Trailhead. My apologies for any mispronunciation. Honey, this could be the toughest hike we've ever done. It might be. Okay. I don't know, all the fire tower was pretty intense. Someone will know if we get lost. I called my mom. Good job, Melissa. And apparently it's supposed to be an amazing view. It's a little cloudy today, so I don't know if we're gonna get to see anything that amazing once we get up there, if we can make it up there. Yes, we might have to do this twice and that's okay. Okay, so what I do, I say is we go to the point and if we get to a point where we're like, no, nope, too steep, something we're not comfortable with, then we'll, we'll stop. Turn back. Stairs. Probably the steepest set of stairs I've ever gone up. Oh, we've gone up lots of stairs. Okay, come on. Can't you just like go with it? <laughs> I'm hopping and popping. <laughs> You're on camera. What do you think thus far, my dear? It's been rugged. It's been a heck of a climb. I'm wishing that we had brought water. Is this harder than the Elba Fire Tower? Yeah. Is this the hardest trail we've done thus far? I think it might be. It's difficult on the way up because of the intensity and the steepness. It'll and just be a different kind of difficult on yeah, the way down. Yeah, exactly. On the way down, it's going to be more about finesse and paying attention, balance, thinking things through. Thigh muscles. People say YouTube is easy. This is not easy. <laughs> Look at I'm wearing this. <laughs> look how goofy I look. We just talked to some hikers. We're about halfway up and it gets really spooky up there. Uh, so a set of steel stairs. <laughs> and then uh, steel chains and then climbing on basically your hands and knees, it sounds like. So I think we'll get to the ladder, decide whether or not we'll go up it, but we're definitely not going beyond that point. No. We're not daredevils. No, not in a day like today. We better get going though. Oh, okay. Melissa says we gotta get going, guys. Come on, let's go. First peak is this way. Okay, and second peak. Okay, we made it about halfway, a little bit beyond halfway, but now it's time to go back down because we are not prepared. I'm not even dressed right. We didn't know we were gonna go hiking. When we went to Whistler, we were thinking we were going snowshoeing one day and then just heading straight back. Then we find out about this amazing hike and go on it. Um, but I shouldn't be in all black. We should have water with us and we should have snacks. So we're gonna be wise and see, that's it. It's been a hell of a hike. It's been the toughest hike I've ever done and we're not even to the top. So, we're going to try it again some yes. other time. Big Chief one this time. This yes. time. <laughs> you know, we need to 
to definitely have some water bottles with us. Is there anything else we need? It'd be nice to have a snack up at the top, but I don't want to be carrying food because I don't think you want to be carrying food. Right, I do not want to be bear bait. <clears throat> Should we get a boom box? No. We've seen people out on the trails with boom boxes before well, you go. Well, although sometimes making that noise is wise. I know you get annoyed, but <laughs> gotta keep the bears away. What's that? Um, movie with the boom box say anything yeah we'll bring one of those boom boxes and just when a bear comes around put it up in the sky and the bear will go running <laughs> getting more prepared for hiking so we've got water bottles one two we've got a dedicated backpack to hiking we got a first aid kit uh we've got a battery pack all right got the bear belt here some snacks this time super prepared we are moon cheese some cliff bars Honey, I think it's official. We could live out in the wilderness <laughs> for hours. Do you think we could? No. So today we're gonna give it another go, see how far we can get. We do have rain to worry about. There's rain in the forecast at two o'clock and we do not wanna be in the rain. We do have our rain jackets though, so we're prepared for you. Hey, do we really want to show everybody the trip up to Squamish? I think everybody's been horrified enough by your driving. Okay, so let's try some trickery. Oh, we're here! Oh my gosh, this is amazing! Before we go on these big hikes, we're supposed to let someone know what we're gonna be doing. So Melissa always texts her mom, because her mom owns a helicopter, <laughs> and if we were to get stranded, she could fly the helicopter to where we are and save us. It's official. She is texted. All right. Let's go. So, we, two little short people, are gonna try to get all the way up there. Is it really all the way up there that yeah. we're supposed to go? We're no. some, somewhere up there. We're not really supposed to go all the way up there. Oh, yeah, we are. No. Definitely not Buttercup. I really don't know where she thinks we're going. Okay, so this is the second time trying this. Do you think it's going to be harder or easier? I think it's going to be easier. One, we're prepared because we know what we're up against. Two, for me, it's like yoga. Once I've done it once on one side, the second side always feels easier. The first side's always more challenging. So I think not knowing makes it hard. What about you? It's wrong <laughs> because I know what it's going to be like. The first part we're going to go through is going to be really hard. So Melissa's wrong. And what do you mean two sides of yoga? What does that even mean? Because you do everything on the right side and then you go and you do everything on the left side. The right side of the room? The right side of the body. Oh, the like right side of the Like you do all of the oh, balance okay. poses and whatnot on one side and then you shift over and do it on the second side. And for me, it's always faster on the second. Okay. It's well, easier. There's only one way to prove it and that's to do it. So. Right. Chief part two. Yes. We are at the base of the trail. Check it out. You ready for this? Yes, I'm ready. Next time you guys see me, I'm gonna be sweating up a storm. All right, let's do this. Harder or easier? I would say it's easier because I, I was able to mentally be prepped for it. Because I want to keep resting. Could you tell us more? Keep talking. No, well, it's time to keep go. Going. We only have so much time okay, before all right, rain. All right, let's go. All right, have we reached the point we reached last time? No, we're not quite that high yet. We're at the point where last time I also needed to take off a layer. And now I need to take off a layer, so. It's funny, the layers come off her and then they go into my backpack. That's making you sweat? You need more time at the gym, sir. Honey, I totally remember the sign because I remember choosing to go toward the first and second peak. Keep in mind, on the, the Schlaney, Schlaney Trail and third peak, those are more rugged. There's a caution sign. And you know what I do? I obey the signs. Okay, honey. Do you remember that rock? Do you remember <laughs> that rock right there? Yes. I will say that the trail gets a little, a little bit less demanding, at least the middle part. It's like there's spots where you get breaks at the beginning when you're going up those stairs. Whew. We 
hold on, turn to, turn that way. Oh, maybe not. There was like steam coming off of, yeah, there's steam coming off of your body. Oh, it's hot. <laughs> oh, wow. Look, it's sun. It's really, really sun. Oh my gosh. It's extremely rare for us to have sun while we're hiking. Are we about to the first peak? I think we are. I think it's just that right there. Oh my gosh. This view is spectacular. And I think we have further to go, or yeah, to try. There are more peaks. I think that look over the ocean. <laughs> yeah. It's not a peak. Huh? I don't even know if it's for sure the first summit. It, the video doesn't do it justice. You gotta do it. You gotta try it. Oh, for do sure. It, try it, do it, try it, <laughs> do it. Although strenuous and a bit tiring, it hasn't been that spooky. But I think the next thing we're coming across is gonna be a little bit more challenging. Good news, bad news. Good news, we already saw something amazing. Bad news is, that wasn't even the first peak. Good news is, maybe it's a more amazing view. Bad news is, we've got some climbing to do. Oh, so what do we do, we go to first peak? I think so. All right, let's do it. Okay, first scary obstacle, we got a ladder. We're almost to the first peak, and we've got another First summit. It. No, it's the first peak. Is it? Yeah, remember? Peak. They were talking peaks. I don't think so. <laughs> yeah, it was peak. Okay. Uh, we've got some obstacles coming up. That's why I got the special gear. Never mind this. Doctor's orders. <laughs> Honey, don't like. I feel like I'm gonna fall. If she fell, that? this is what she would fall. And There's yes, no cliffs you are here. right. First peak. What? Say Chris, again. Chris is right. We're going to the first peak. You wish you needed what? I had watched. I don't know how to do it. You might just have to stand up and do it. You can do it. Come on, huh? Although I shouldn't get so cocky. You got it? Yeah, that was fun. Maybe I will like mountain climbing, huh? Ooh. <sighs> wow. I'm glad you said the technique out loud. I think I'll do that too. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Melissa has reached her peak. I totally understand, but I'm not that much further to go. I'm gonna go to the top. You're gonna wait for me though, right, hon? Okay. Give me a few minutes, the view so far.
I tackled some things I wouldn't have thought that I would be able to tackle. I did scramble. I held onto a chain to pull me up higher, and I made it to a peak. And it was well worth it. Try the chief, I dare ya. All right, what do you think, hon? I think it's gorgeous up here, but I I think this is a little beyond my league. If you want to do this much, I think you'll be on your own. <laughs> so, if I, <laughs> hiking. so if I want to hike beyond uh, this type of hike, you're not in. Nope, not that in. scramble. Are you a little surprised you did the scramble, though, that you held the chains, went up higher? I didn't know it was called the scramble. Yeah, and then okay. you climbed up the ladders. Are you a little surprised you did it? No, I thought I'd feel more comfortable than I do, but I feel oh, like the really? wind is picking up, and I'm getting cold, and I want to go. Okay. I actually would have thought I would have chickened out and said, no, I'm not going to do that. So I'm surprised. Yeah, I'm surprised too because you have a bigger fear of heights than I do. Yeah, so, but I do think it's going to be a little harder going down because yeah. you see where you're going. Yeah. All right, let's do this. She's so cute. So we made it to the first peak. That's all we're going to do. But we got to hurry because clouds are coming in. Looks like rain. We did it. Yes, we did. That was quite the hike. That's quite the hike. I would say that is the most difficult hike I've ever done in my life. Likewise. Endurance wise, I felt good. Yeah. I still felt good. I, I, I too. It was what I expected. But the payoff at the end or at the top was incredible. Now, Chris made it up further on the, the peak than I did because I just, it was enough for me uh, and I did not want more at all. Uh, however, I didn't think about it until after I asked you to just go ahead that really we should not be separated on the trail like that. Yeah. Like, I mean, it was, there were other people going by. It wasn't a big deal. You could have got abducted. But I did get nervous. Well, I wasn't worried about that. I was worried about one of us getting injured and the other not knowing, no. and then I couldn't get up higher to you. And... Bigfoot come, could have came along and taken you? <laughs> well, I don't know. He likes the, the blonde cuties. <laughs> you think so? Yeah. I am kind of a mess, and that's okay because sometimes you have to slide down the side of the mountain to get down it. Oh, yeah. I had a bit of a panic attack. Let's see. Let's see what, where you were sliding. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> I was like, I actually spider walked. Leisure testing complete. And can we do double thumbs up fun? Oh. Double thumbs up fun. Could you maybe like and subscribe? <laughs> Please. If you'd like. If you'd like, it's your choice, you know. Oh, you could ring that bell. Yeah, ring the bell. What the hell? Ring that bell. Actually, I think you have to subscribe first and then you can ring the bell. You can't just ring the bell and not